Face back. Here's Maggio. And on the other side, a pass on the left wing board just knocked down. Schaller trying to get loose. Still in skates and now cleared in to Rochester's own. And it's whistled down. And we'll have a stoppage of play back out at center ice. The gloves have been dropped. It is heard against uh, Frederick Waugh. Waugh, the much smaller, coming through with the right hand. Heard. He is trying to protect himself. Giving the left jab. Waugh is trying to cover up and come back with a big right hand again. Looking for the uppercut. Heard and Waugh. There's Waugh with the uppercut. He stunned Heard. And they go down. And Freddie Waugh again, much smaller, but he got in some pretty good shots. Well, uh, Frederick Waugh, son of... Famed goaltender Patrick Law, who's not, who is known for his fisticuffs. Definitely at 5'10", 168, taking on Mitchell Hurd, 6'175". I think he got the better of him there. Scott Metcalf called that one right, as you're going to see here. Out to the neutral, right near the neutral zone on the ice. The gloves come off. These two already got it worked out. It's off camera right now, but now they start coming in. And Waugh gets the sweater up over the head. He keeps pulling them. You can see a couple of left jabs with that hand that's got a hold of it. And eventually Hurd's sweater gets up over, and then Waugh starts to feed him the right. But Waugh tries to keep his distance as uh, he definitely shows up 5'10". He's not going to take any back seats for anyone. Even on penalties, and uh, I don't know if that maybe is some payback for what happened a couple of games ago when Hurd sucker punched the defenseman Rasmus Ristolainen, who has been out, has not played since that night. Yeah, he was out there suffering, uh, you know.